What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here back with another little update on Optic Gaming and the whole buyout situation. Apparently now, ESPN is reporting that Immortals have now purchased Infinite Esports for around 35 to 45 million dollars. And that happened this past week on May 30th and now, Basically, the organizations are just finalizing all the legal paperwork in order to make the deal official. But if you guys don't know, Infinite Esports are like the parent company for Optic Gaming and the rest of their esports team. Because a few years ago, Optic was sold, a part of Optic was sold, I should say, to Infinite Esports. And I'm not sure about the exact details of what went on with that, like the contracts and uh, the different shares, etc. But obviously Hex was not able to stop Infinite from making this decision to sell the Optic brand. And yeah, right now it's a very troublesome time for us fans. And I'm sure for all the pro players right now because we don't know if Optic's COD team will have to rebrand to Immortals. Or even if they're going to have a spot next year in the Call of Duty World League. But it was reported next year that Immortals are looking to buy a spot in the city-based World League. Um, but just, you know, right now those are just rumors. We're, we're not sure if Optic is even going to have a team um, coming into next season for CWL. So like I said, very, very troublesome times right now for the fans and for the pro players. There is some good news though. At least that's what I can interpret from this article. Now also take into consideration that none of this is actually officially confirmed either, but from what it does look like is Optic can still be a brand, it's just under Immortals. But again, we, we don't know if they are actually interested in buying that CWL spot for next season, which in itself is an entirely different issue because franchising could possibly not take off as expected with the COD esports industry. So maybe Immortals may see it as a risky investment, who knows? What I can see and say with certainty though is that the League of Legends team will definitely not be around. They're going to have to rebrand to Immortals because that's what the company was interested in the entire time. Like that's why they wanted to buy Optic was solely for that League of Legends team. All the extra teams are just, you know, extra stuff. And that's what Immortals basically had an eye for the prize on. But for the Houston Outlaws, they will probably end up being sold since Immortals already has an Overwatch League team. But for the Call of Duty team, like I said, it's so crazy because there's so many different options and outcomes that can happen. But the most ridiculous decision that could happen is that they just rebrand Optic to Immortals. Um, because think about it, they basically control the Call of Duty esports scene right now. There's so much money that Immortals can profit off of because Optic as a brand has so much sales and merchandise, you know, t-shirts, controllers, jerseys, etc. Immortals can gain so much and I just don't see fans wanting to support a team that's not actually Optic, that doesn't have the Optic brand. Um, but either way though, what, what's happening right now really sucks for us fans, it really really does. I've been a fan of Optic since Modern Warfare 2 during the Frag Cup days, which was a really 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 long time ago. Hopefully you guys out there that are watching may, may remember that. Um, but yeah, you know, again, it sucks what's happening right now. Hex says no matter what though, there is going to be good news coming out of this. I know he did try to buy the Optic brand from Infinite Esports, but they rejected his offer and apparently his bid was substantially more than whatever Immortals offered, so that in itself seems a little bit, you know, suspicious right there. Um, but if any news comes out, guys, I'll make sure to keep you all updated. And make sure to leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy. And also comment down below your thoughts. Thanks for watching. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.